In this video, I will show you how to perform an API gravity test. The tools you will need are a graduated cylinder, a API gravity hydrometer, and you only need a thermometer and a hot plate if you're working with products like crude oil. <coughs> but we won't need those things because we're working with a product that you can measure at room temperature. API gravity is a measure of how heavy or light a liquid is compared to water. If the, its API gravity is greater than 10, it is lighter and floats on water. If it is less than 10, it he it's heavier and it sinks. So, you take a cylinder and you pour your oil or your cooking oil, like we're using, into it. So it's about uh, three quarters full so that when you put the hydrometer in, it won't overflow. <coughs> so that's about that. Next, uh, you grab a hydrometer, and to pick out the correct hydrometer, you should be able to put it in a liquid so that it doesn't sink to the bottom, and so that it doesn't lean over to the side when you put it in the, in the oil and <clears throat> you want it to, when you put it in, so it floats until it's on these measurements right here. So you place the hydrometer in the liquid and you push the meter to about right there, so, or actually down there, and you, oh crap, you let it go and it's about 24 which means the API gravity is lighter and it will float on top of water. So <clears throat> when you're done clean up your equipment, put your tools back where they belong and you have successfully completed an API gravity test.